No such health concerns for Jacoby Ellsbury. Go ahead, knock on wood. But the American League MVP runner-up was not only crazy productive last season, he was also plenty durable. A far cry and a stark contrast from a disastrous 2010. And if you're worried about where the Sox center fielder goes from here, don't be. Because the only upside to an MVP snub is being motivated by an MVP snub. Jacoby Ellsbury and his new bench boss are the big story, presented by Sun Life Financial. Well, we're playing against the best competition in the world. Um, you know, obviously I did everything I could, left it all on the field last year. And um, when the results, when I found out about the results, um, you know, I was, I was happy for Justin, Justin Verlander. But at the same time, me being competitive as I am, you know, I, I wish I would have won. Um, you know, I bet if you asked all those other guys, they would have said the same thing too. But I definitely held my head high, finishing second. I thought he was the MVP personally. I mean, I just thought his year was phenomenal from... The opening day that I saw him in Texas, he, his swing seemed to be so consistently good. Um, his defense was terrific. Watching him at the end of the year, it looked like he was given the at-bats that were needed. And the numbers speak for themselves. I mean, I, I don't know how you get those numbers. Whatever he thinks the team needs, if it's better for me to hit down in the order or stay a leadoff, um, you know, I'm gonna I'm gonna do whatever he feels best. Uh, you know, to get us the most wins. Right now, I'm just you know trying to get my timing, trying to get everything like that. But I'm sure, um, you know, here in a couple of weeks, that uh, you know I could probably have a better answer for you. Well, the numbers certainly support Bobby V's case for a center fielder. You see, Ellsbury was at or near the top of just about every major offensive category in 2011. In what should go without saying was certainly a career year for a guy who'd never received a single MVP vote to that point.